What's up, Peak Timers? Today we're getting a close up look at some Tarmac Works Premium 1 in 64 scale Audi R8s. Let's go ahead, open them up, and get a close up look at them. We'll start it off with this one here, and all of these have some very unique, awesome looking designs and tampo artwork on them. So let's go ahead and open these up. And just so you guys know, I'll leave the link in the description below so you can check out these cars, you can check out pricing, you can check out the Tarmac Works website. Uh, so we'll open that one up and we'll actually open this little casing right here too so you guys can get a closer look at it. This one's pretty tightly on there and we'll take it off right now. And and if we look at this, it even gives some more specifics on who exactly this is. Uh, personally, I'm not a big watcher of the GT3 series cars, so you guys will probably know more information about the drivers of these and the specifics of these cars in real life, but check it out. Check out the detail on these cars. So great looking. Um, I'm not gonna unscrew these ones. Um, some of the other ones I did unscrew, but I'm gonna keep these on the plate. These are definitely not toys. These are ones that you're going to be displaying. So if you want cars to play with, Hot Wheels are the ones. But if you want some really good, high quality, detailed one in 64 cars, then Tarmac Works are a great choice in that matter. And check it out from the side. We'll get some more close up looks at the car all the way around. And once I open all these up, we'll get some close-ups of all the cars together. But check it out from the top right there. Audi R8 LMS. Fantastic looking car. All right, let's go ahead to the next one. And here we have the next variation of it. And we'll actually look about uh, the packaging all around so you guys can see great quality packaging. I like the gold lettering all around. It's a like chrome gold all around to kind of match the vehicle. Well, let's go ahead and open this one up here. And you can choose if you want to keep the box and packaging and stuff for your cars. I'll leave that up to you. But uh, let's go ahead and open this one up. They are pretty secure when you get them first of all, so you can take it out. But we'll take a look at that one. Wow, like the amazing detail like I just don't know how they do this like it's just crazy how they have like the chrome with it looks like all the race car track and stuff on this one I'll give you a close-up look on the specifics and details of this one as well from the actual driver so you can see who it is and which one they finished in and you can see it from the front some great detail to it. And these ones do have like real rubber wheels on there as well, if you ever take it off, but uh, you probably wanna leave it on. Check out that big spoiler as well. Looks fantastic. Love this one. Uh, like I said, we'll compare them all side by side together once they're all opened, but this one does look great as well. All right, we'll put this one aside, we'll get to the last one. And last but not least, we've got this one right here, and this one looks like it's got some sort of like camo paint job on it. So uh, let's go ahead and open this one up and get a look at this. As I rip it right open here, throw that all on the side, and let's get this plastic casing right off so we can get a close up look at it. And there we go. There it is. Check out the camo work on that one. And again, the detail in the paintwork and artwork and all of that on there. And as far as I know, these cars were actually done a few different concept variations of these cars and they redid them a few times just to make sure the proportions and dimensions of this car were exactly perfect and exactly to real life. So that you can see the, the thoughtfulness that Tarmac Works puts into their cars to make sure they're absolutely perfect is definitely there. And I'll show you there right there so you can see uh, who the actual driver in stuff is of this car, R8 LMS, but a great looking one, very nice casting of this car. All right guys, well, let's go ahead and see all three of these ones together now.
What's up, Peak Timers? This is your boy Phil from Peak Time Racing. I just want to thank you all for watching this video. Now, I just want to make sure you guys are fully aware of the Peak Time Racing brand, which consists of all three of these channels right here. We've got Peak Time Racing, which is the channel you're on right now. We've got Peak Time Vlogs, which is my vlogging channel where you can find more stuff about my daily life, my family, and a lot more behind the scenes things, as well as Peak Time TV, which is my gaming channel. Mixed in with a little bit of a storyline channel with Hot Wheels, some really cool stories and Hot Wheels stuff in there as well. I just want to make sure you guys don't miss out on a video that I post, so be sure to subscribe to all three of those channels. I will be doing a monthly giveaway and all you have to do to enter is post on any one of my videos and any one of my channels that you are subscribed to all three of the Peak Time Racing branded channels. I'll be picking one lucky winner each month at random who will receive a prize package of Peak Time Racing branded things as well as Hot Wheels. Thanks again for watching this one. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.